guys, welcome back to Chemistry with Kat. I'm Kat and today we are going to be learning the difference between atomic number and atomic mass. The atomic number for an element is the number you see in the top corner or sometimes the top middle of the periodic table. Every element has their own atomic number. This number represents the number of protons in the atom. You cannot share this number with another element. For example, every single element that has four protons is going to be beryllium. Every single element that has an atomic number of 17 is going to be chlorine and it's going to have 17 protons. If you change the number of protons in an atom, it becomes another atom. That is the one thing that can never change in an element. Now, the mass number is made up of the protons and the neutrons that sit inside the nucleus. You might be wondering why aren't electrons included in that? Electrons are very important when it comes to the charge. Electrons are negative and protons are positive and they are equivalent when it comes to charge. However, they're not equivalent when it comes to mass. Electrons are so small that we say that they're negligible when it comes to the atomic mass. However, protons and neutrons are heavy and that is what creates the atomic mass. In the periodic table, the atomic mass is usually right under the element. We use the atomic mass to calculate how many neutrons are in an atom and also isotopic abundance. Those videos will be coming up very soon on my channel. If you would like to own this beautiful periodic table that is actually a shower curtain, I'll put the link in the description of this video. I got it on Amazon for 25 bucks and I love it. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like and subscribe to my channel for more.